Hey, it's Lonnie with Crafty Traveler doing another video today and uh, I'm going to be putting on this LED strip light kit onto my featherweight that I put the crank on. Um, the light won't work if I'm not using electricity and since I've taken the electrical part out with the motor that's not going to work. However, this LED strip is uh, USB, so it's 12 volt. So in the, at night, if I'm in the trailer and I want to sew, I will have lights most of the time because we'll probably be on power, but um, I won't be able to turn this light on. But with this, I can have light. Um, not only does it plug into the USB, so even if I'm not plugged into shore power or electricity 110, um, the lights still run on 12 volt. So I can um, attach it to 12 volt. If I do, if I am on shore power, then I have an adapter. So stay tuned and I'll show you how to put this on. So I watched a video about how to do this. Hope I remember. Watched it a couple times. Um, and I'm going to be hooking the the cording on this part of the machine just to kind of use it as a guide and then hold it in position with my hand for a moment and bring it around underneath the machine and it fits pretty well I don't think I have to trim it at all um, to do that so I need to take this red stripping off and this is a very sticky adhesive here start in the same place and bring it up along the machine underneath and press it in so it adheses okay that's pretty good now they've also um, given me these little clips, it looks like. I probably should have used those to hook them on. Let me see if I do that here. No, no I don't think I'm going to do that. We'll see how long that stays on. I'll keep these clips for future reference and uh, see how it works. So I'm going to plug this into a USB extension because the plug is behind me. And then it has a little switch and voila we have lights so now I can sew when I'm not hooked up to shore power if need be um, or if just have the the 12 volt and it gives me plenty of light on this little machine and I can crank and sew away I'll try and reference the video that I did about how to put this crank piece on uh, and remove the motor. So if you're interested in doing that, you can look at that. Okay? If you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. That helps me and it, the thumbs up helps people find the video. And uh, give me a comment about what you liked about my video. Also, um, give me a comment about what you would like me to video. 
I do arts, crafts, quilting, sewing, traveling, and some product reviews. Okay, Happy New Year and stay crafty!